what's up Zee Ninjas? Today we will be doing some more Hitman 3. As I said, I said I was going to carry this series on, so I'm going to carry this series on. So let's jump in to Hitman 3. And if you're wondering which video this is, this is the third video. Make sure you watch my first and second video because it, it, it was a good one. So, last time, Green Ninja, we left off at where we was going to. I think it's like Mexico. I think it's Mexico. Let me, let me go check. Uh, left off going to the Ninjas. We were left off going to. Welcome to Colombia 47. The remote village of Santa Fortuna awaits you deep inside the Colombian rainforest. An iron fisted Delgado cartel rules over the village and its surroundings. Security around Santa Fortuna and the closed off cartel compound is extremely tight. Armed Sicarios patrol the streets of the village, ready to enforce harsh punishments to those who do not comply. Rumors persist of hidden transportation cave systems connecting the village, the cartel compound, and the hidden coca fields beyond. It is a rare occurrence to have all three cartel leaders present in the village at the same time. Expect that all targets are protected by scrupulous killers armed with automatic weapons. Rico Delgado inhabits his fortified mansion on the outskirts of the village while Andrea Martinez can be found in her village office or around Santa Fortuna itself. And Jorge Franco is engaged in development of a new drug in his field laboratory. Happy hunting, 47. So, the ever-classy Rico Delgado has commissioned a statue of himself to adorn the village square. Oh. 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 Does that foundation look entirely stable to you? Well, well. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That way. Keep going. What? Why are you following me?
Alright, maybe let's just restart this mission for a sec. So it's, we need a wrench. We need a wrench. We need a wrench. We need a wrench. Here. When the rig show is ready, I'm gonna take the tourists down the mountain road. I'd watch the bird change fall out. I wouldn't come to this I remember when you offered those one day guided tours through the jungle, got lost, and barely made it out alive. Only half the tour group. And how may I help you today, senor? Escuchando. Still looking. Oh my god, a 
Have you heard that Angelica, a royal highness, and to get a job because one left? See you, soldier. Rico Delgado coming down to us dirty villagers to unveil some ridiculous statue. Sure. I want to follow them and the band were really good. Nice day. about the Moreno. How they had 15 guys in lockup in Mala, and yet all of them walked two hours after bringing Rocky. Uh, that's only half the story. Martinez has spent six months setting them up in the Guatemala military under the cover of the ghost. And they were practically at the compound, ready to raid the whole place, take down everyone, you know, and then, ooh, nothing. Fifteen guys running... Ay, Dios mío! Ay, my head! There's like someone looking out for them. Someone powerful, clearly. And it's pushing us the bottom of your mouth. Down. Good work. Ah, sorry, 
a man. Nothing so far. This area seems clear. We're moving on. Anyway, next is these. What's up, man? Sit down. Relax. The universe will correct itself again, right? I don't know, man. I've been, like, smuggling this cocaine souvenir around the world, right? I need to get into this dude, uh, Franco. But man, it, it broke. It's supposed to be in one piece when I deliver it over by some cave entrance behind the pharmacy. But it broke. Bummer, man. So, uh, maybe just glue it together? I don't know. Hold up, Joseph. Oh, Jesus H. Christ. Get out of the way. I'm getting the guards to deal with this evolutionary leftover. Oh, you, you gotta, gotta do, do something. something. Excuse, Excuse me, it's too gruesome. No! Ah, oh, one love. I'd like to buy some glue, please. No, I'm afraid we just ran out of that item, senor. I sold the last bottle to the mechanic next door. Do you sell glue? A la puta! Muchas gracias por su trabajo.
Already find a stone. Oh man, that sounds like a massive hassle. Maybe later, you know. Now I just need to find you. You stepped in my way. You stupid empty thing. Oh, you're in my way. Oh my god, you literally stepped in front of me. Not in the mood for this today. Oh, come on. Crap. What? Will you quit that? Why would you tangle? <laughs> need to check your pockets if you want to Peace and love isn't really my thing. Isn't this kind of work sort of breaking the hippie code? I do what it takes to get what I need. Franco, the Delgado Cartel's chief chemist. Ah, so, despite an annoying delay, it's finally here. Let's have a look. Excuse me. It got through customs without a problem, we hope? I had no issues. Excellent. Nice one, 47. 
And now for Franco to sample his handiwork. Through taste. Franco confirmed down. Nice work, 47. Something over there that will listen. I mean, I keep seeing them skating around in that slippery bit looking for fun. Not just any pass, alright. It's a rare pass. That's the point. Must be very important to him to risk his life on it. I guess. Delgado wrote for Martinez. I have to jump out of a window before Hector discovered it.
That is Rico Delgado, head of the Delgado drug cartel. Come on, get down, clean up. This baseball bat was for a long time my signature weapon. As a young man, I worked as an enforcer for the traitorous Moreno cartel, and the bat was. So, my friend, you wanted to look inside my trophy room, huh? All right, all right. I'll give you the name. I have to say, boss, you have some impressive pieces of it. It is taken years and lots of blood, sweat, and tears to get some of these items. Mostly the blood, sweat, and tears of people. Martinez had an affair with Rico? Does Catalina know about this? No, no, not Rico. Hector, the other Delgado. In here. Yeah. No, it's Mama. Mm -hmm. Mexican pueblos together back in the day. Bonnie and Clyde kind of thing. There are lots of rumors about them, but most are fake. Interesting office set up 47. If I'm not mistaken, Rico's looking to add some tattoo work to his already substantial collection. Oh, yeah. Um, oh, I know where he is. Is it tattoo artist? Step back. Let's probe through there. Celebrity tattoo artist and reality TV star. Mate, I'm telling you, I've been in some crazy shit before, but this takes the cake. Mm -hmm. I know where I'm supposed to be right now. The Delgado Mansion. Just knock on the front gate, listen. And then what? 
walk in and tattoo the world's most notorious cartel boss. I can see how that's not easy. Ah, uh, so, pea power. And he kills me just for fun. Imagine what he'd do to me if I messed up. Oh, sure, he's dangerous. And it's his wife. What? Have a look at that, huh? Will you? Sure thing. Don't you go! To give you a bad down if you want to come through here, Panzero. You're entering the lion's den, so you you're probably you're Tread carefully. Step, Practically step. everyone here is dangerous, not least Rico Delgado himself. Well, All right, good. Mr. Power. Keep moving. Keep Follow moving. me to the house. Mrs. Delgado wanted to meet you. She's a big fan. She'll take you to Rico afterwards. Uh, there's celebrity tattoo guys here. So famous tattoo artist, huh? Put some ink on his skin as well in my time. Of course, most of that was in prison, and not always on people who appreciated the work. I wonder, are those tattoos to tattoo traitor on a guy's forehead while he's squirming around on the ground like a wall? Not easy, let me tell you. Interesting story. Thank you for sharing. You bet. Oh my god! I'm gonna be dead honest with you. I've got my ex-girlfriend Margarita's name tattooed on my groin. And I want to get into something else. Would you I just love your show. Go on in. Just standing around here, huh? That time policeman while they're administrating CPR. <laughs> it's the most beautiful thing I've ever seen. A great moment. I cherish the memory to this day. Let's <sighs> see. So, Rico has this tattoo on his neck, and he insists it's supposed to be based on the photo me. I'm not a fool, Mr. Powers. My nose never looked like that, not even before the operation. And sure, I've had a few ticks done here and there, but nothing as drastic as that. I want you to make it look like me, not some young skank. I'll do my very best, Mrs. Toka. Oh, Chico, let me just grab a quick selfie with you, all right? Sure, why not? Just look this way. Oh, I can see. Wow, we look so good together. This is great. By the way, your husband's cheating on you. Did you hear me? Well. Maybe. So 
far so good. Now to leave your mark on Mr. Delgado. So, this is the famous P Power, tattoo artist to the stars. Huh. You don't exactly look like you do on TV, do you? There's something different about you. Cariño, don't insult our guest. He's obviously not been sitting in a stylist chair for days, but this. Hey, what are you doing? The session's in here, man. Don't go wandering around my house. Hey, man. How much for a cover up that do? Don't insult our guests. I'm not dating my He's obviously not been sitting in a stylist chair for days, but this is P Power. Who else would it be? Well, what about those cheekbones? The guy on TV didn't have cheekbones like that. Hey, Rico, enough. You know they fix all that in post production. Just let the man work. Okay, fine. Whatever you say. Okay, I'm ready. Let's get this thing fixed. You are really getting on my nerves now. I'm just grabbing a few shots for the socials. Relax, Rico. I find your constant photography very annoying, dear. I really can't see what the problem is. Whoa, hey, Rico, don't worry. I've got this under control. Hey, tattoo guy, I'm watching you. One wrong move, you know, You need to keep idiot. still, Mr. Delgado. I wouldn't want to stab you by accident. You heard the man, Catalina. Leave us now. Fine. Have it your way. But that tattoo better look exactly like me when you're done with your new BFF, Rico. Hey, relax, Jose. We're fine. Just making sure the script doesn't try anything funny. Hey, I need you to stand down. Stop waving that thing around. No way. I'm letting my guard down around this. Stranger, Rico. So what are we waiting for, huh? I'm here, I'm ready. Get on with it. Hey, Jose, I need you to leave us alone now. You're too wound up right now. You understand? All right, boss, all right. But I'll be back in a little while if I don't hear from you, boy, boy. Oh, finally. So be so quiet. Can I finish my work now? <laughs> do what you do best, man. You got it. Targets neutralized. This should paralyze the cartel. Excellent work, Wilson. Now head for an exit.